part four. Welcome, everyone. All righty. We are back for part four of our Tomb Raider adventure. And I think it's about time we got started. How the hell is everyone doing today? I keep saying I'm going to go and do Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, but man, I just feel like I want to get this one complete first. Yosukai says, morning in Florida. It is indeed, but it's afternoon here, so that's okay. What have we got? What's this? What is that? That's a weird looking texture right there. Huh. Doesn't even mean anything. That's, uh, yeah. I'm not sure what they were playing at with that one. Door is locked. All right. Oh, I need to bring the block in here. Tot, 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 drinker. Just not good enough. Grooms and Shadow says, hey, drinker, first time tuning in from Edinburgh. Well, welcome, sir. You're not even that far away from me right now. We should meet up. Have a beer. Cody says, how's the weather in Scotland? It's sunny, but cold. And there was me thinking, you know, it's March now. We're almost into spring. It's going to start warming up. But the weather was like, nah, it'll be fine. Yes. <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's four in the morning here in Mississippi. I know, but we're not in Mississippi right now, are we? Well, at least I'm not. That is some weird texture work going on on the floor there. I don't know what that's about. I guess the engine that they've got... Ah, right, okay, so it's doors. <laughs> no, rats! I feel like I'm fighting the Skaven from Warhammer. Right, let's see what's down here. Anything interesting for us? Ah, yes. The cistern. This is quite the area. And I'm going to be honest. I have got no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. So, let's do some exploring. Okay, can't go through that door. Can we go through this one over here? Nope, that's locked. So, all right. Process of elimination, gentlemen. There's a rat just hanging around there. Seems like we may have to go over that way, actually, because there's nothing here that's particularly useful for me. All right. Back the way we came. Let's see if we can actually make this. This is a very relaxing song, you're right. Oh, you motherfucker! <laughs> How can a rat knock you off the edge? That's just disgusting behaviour, and I won't condone it. What we got? That feels like the kind of place that a boulder should roll down from. Yeah, it looks like it. Could be my only way out. Oh my god, I'm trapped here forever! Should probably try and take out these crocodiles as well. Is there another one? Yeah, fuck you, rat. There's the other one. Let's go check this out, see if there's anything in here that I need. Ooh, a gap. Let's see if I can get in through here. No, nothing there, apart from seaweed. Someone did mention that there's a key here on this level that's apparently really difficult to view in the remaster. Which doesn't fill me with much joy. I know in the cistern you have to, like, constantly raise and lower the water. Oh, is that it? Is that... That's a key. So... 
some kind of switch there. How does one get to it though? Let's see what we got here. All right. So that's blocked off for now. We have to carry on swimming, I think. Anything here? All right. Up. Yeah. Can we get out here? No. The water level is too low. Well, that's no good. Yeah, someone's suggesting switching to classic graphics occasionally. That's probably not a bad idea. But man, oof. It's tough on the old eyes. <laughs> Process of elimination. So we couldn't get anything there. We have to look around a bit more. Anything over here that I need? Oh, another entrance way. Right, that could be our way forward. Let's see what we got down here. Oh, it's just a secret. Magnum rounds. I mean, it's never bad to have them, I suppose. Get some air. Let's see what else is down that tunnel. I was pretty sure it carries on a little further. Let's see what's at this end. Oh, does it just spit me back out into the main area? Okay, fine. Right, it's time to start exploring. <laughs> Square ass and pyramid cities. Quite, quite right, MJ. That's just the way God intended it. <laughs> Is this where a boulder's going to roll down onto me and make me go squish? I need to be able to get up here. At the very least. Well, she should make that. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, up you go, Lara. So the first thing we're going to have to do is raise the water level. Otherwise, we can't get anywhere. Ah, hello. Hello. What dick. <sighs> do I have unlimited ammo? You do for the pistols, but not for anything else. And they're quite stingy with their shotgun ammo, I don't mind saying. But, hey-ho, you can always fall back on the pistols and they sound good, if nothing else. Make you feel better about yourself. All right. Must be that switch over there, then. Ooh, I see things. Secret things. Let me see if I can make that jump. Some nice ambience going on here. Ah, couldn't make that. May have to go this way. See if she can do it. And up. Cool. I'll have that stuff. Uh, Hunter Black Blurin is saying, have I seen the new character model released by Crystal Dynamics? Uh, yeah, so they've... They've got Lara in her classic outfit, but, oh, man, they've made her a bit masculine looking. Like, she's got a really just angry, um, manly looking face. Not the beautiful Lara that I remember, and yeah, they've reduced certain assets, which I don't approve of in the slightest. Lara's supposed to be curvaceous. Oh crap. Look at that. Would have fallen in there. Anyway, let's get this switch done. Well, something happened, that's for sure. 
Do I want to go in there? Should I? Could I? Would I? There's a lot of rats there. Alright, let's go in. See what's there. Must be something worth picking up in here, surely. Does this just spit us back out into the main area again? Or is this a different room? Different room, by the looks of it. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Well, looks like the upper hand is on the other foot now, huh? <laughs> Sarah's saying those rats are massive, what the fuck? I mean, this is a game that's got, like, actual legit dinosaurs in it, so... Rats are probably the least of our problems. What's that over there? Not much. Got a feeling I've got to hang here and crawl my way along. Doesn't look all that high, weirdly enough. <laughs> Crimson Shadow. A right big whore of a rat there, drinker, eh? That's it. Oh, there's nothing here. Fuck it. Kill him. Yeah. Is there going to be something up there? Oh, is that a block? I wonder if that's a block that I have to push out so I can crawl along. Let's see what's over here. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot going on in there. Right, let's try it. Let's just go here and slide. Come on, slide. Okay, so now our room is filled with water, and that's good. Makes me feel real good. I just got to decide where to go next. Hmm. Yeah, so I could go along there. What would be the point, though? Just use it to get that. Look, von Tajikistan. Cheers to you, drinker. Having a German pilsner in my hands. Not a bad choice. I approve. Two things that Germans make extremely well are cars and beer. I don't like both of those things. Okay, next area. We're probably going to get over here so that we can get some doors opened. Are you serious? Well, that's not going to no. get it open. Okay, this is my confused face now. Nothing over there. I've been up there already. Must be an area I can swim to. Maybe there's something along here. OK, 
Okay. Oh, wait, actually, here's a thought. Yes, I know where I need to go. It's down here. It was that area that I couldn't get to before because the water level was too low. Should be alright to do it now. And that'll be the rat. Oh, you're going to get fucked up, son. Oh, Oscarson says, Drinker, have you tried Hell Divers 2 yet? No, I haven't, but I was talking to Moller about it last night, and everything he told me made it sound amazing, so I'm fully on board for playing it. I think he, it's multiplayer as well, isn't it? So get a bunch of hand picked men, fellow YouTubers, and do it together. Right. To the next room. Go, Lara. If you don't get caught on the scenery, that is. Okay. New room. New opportunities. New ways to get killed. Did you climb out there? No. All right, we're just straight up swimming through. Okay, fine. Yeah, I've not done gaming with Az for ages, and that makes me sad. So, I need to do that. Ah, spikes, eh? Well, I know what I'm going to do. Derek L says, how's my movie release? Oh, you bastard. Trying to get me to jump, eh? He's got to walk slow and steady when you're dealing with spikes. Uh, yes, my movie release, looking good. I mean, we've put the first trailer out. People seem to be liking it so far. And it's due to come out probably in the next month or two. It's just about ready to go. Yeah. Well, I can't go this way because there's a door in my way. Well, that's no good. I have to go back the way I came. Damn rats are everywhere. All right. Oh, no, that's not what I want. People did say that there's certain keys that are hard to find if you're in the new graphics mode. So there you go, I've changed it over. Maybe there's something I've missed here. Oh, a rat just kind of hanging there. <laughs> How's it going, sir? Yeah, there's no way I can climb out here because it's too... It's too high up. She can't pull herself out there. How do you get these doors open then? I must admit, I'm slightly confused by this. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah. <laughs> Hope the rat isn't covering the key, yeah. Oh, wait. Here we go. That's what I need. And it's the one that's directly beneath me, which is handy, I suppose. Like going slightly easier on me for a change, not forcing me to retrace my steps quite so far. Because it could really be any of them. No. Not that one, apparently. Are you sure, though, Lara? <laughs> Almost made that. Should have had it, not gonna lie. Try this one. I got a feeling it might be the big door up there, but we'll check just to be safe because I don't want to keep constantly retracing my steps. No. Alright. 
Woo. All right, we'll try the big one then. Go forward. Hey, there we go. Good job, Lara. Good job. Now we need another key. I assume this one is not going to do the trick. No. Alright. So we're part of the way there. But we've still got a ways to go. Hmm, where's the best place to go next? It's the real question. Anything else here that I'm missing? We can't go up there, I don't think, because I'll just slide. Okay. Alright. So, I've got to go on the hunt for more levers. over here. There's another key there. have to get that open somehow though. Let's get some air. Alex's channel watched June 2 today. Solid 8 of 10. 8 out of 10, sorry. I think that's fair. Good movie. Uh, we had a good chat about it on Open Bar last night and it was, it was really tough because, you know, we didn't want to spoil it for anyone, but there was things about the film we wanted to discuss at the same time so we tried to strike a balance but I kind of get where guys like Mauler were coming from that you know uh, it's a very clinical very precisely made movie very technically impressive not necessarily that huge in terms of heart um, and uh, not huge on the sort of emotional investment in the characters which is a shame because I think the potential was definitely there but overall I'd still take it over like 98% of the crap being produced today so you know I didn't mind it too much I think there should be something else in here what am I missing nope nothing is there something in amongst the spikes that I'm not seeing? Doesn't look like it. This could be the first instance of actually getting stuck on this game and not being sure where to go next or what to do. I mean, if in doubt, with Tomb Raider, it's like pretty much search every room, every area, try every possible switch, and so on. Uh, someone suggesting me and the Friday Night Tights crew team up to play Helldivers. <laughs> that would be good fun. I'd be up for that. I definitely want Gary on board, because he's a hardcore gamer, as we know. Ah, someone's saying there's a key outside the cistern as well. Let's just check that. Make sure I haven't missed anything. I'll put it into the old graphics mode just so I can be sure. Uh, well, I can't go up there. No, there's no way up, so... Everything I need, presumably, is in here. Unless the level design is absolutely horrendous, which is always a possibility. Uh, think, drinker, think. What else do we need from this place? Let's 
try over here. Oh, don't want to go up there. Let's see if there's anything I can find. It's a bit weird that there's just a random area over there with nothing in it. I mean, I can't even see a key over there, so I presume it's not, it's not there. Okay. Can you jump over there? No, because there's a barrier in the way. Let's see what we got up here. Presumably I'm missing something. Maybe there's two switches here that I've got to pull. It's a very big room. Presumably there's a reason for all these blocks up here. Maybe I just need to keep climbing. Oh yeah, okay. Probably is something to be done here. Let's try over here. She can usually jump too. I don't know if she can get up this high. Oh yeah, she can. Right, uh, it's up there. Okay. My bad. Oh, this better not just be a secret. I need actual game progression here. I'm not just here for secrets. That is a lot of shotgun shells there. Okay. We have them. Okay, back in this room. Whoa. Ooh, that's terrifying. <laughs> Ooh, damn. Yeah. It's always weird that they animate things like the tongue and stuff separately. Like, ugh. Okay, I don't think I can jump that, though. That's the problem. So, being over there... Yeah, why does this room feel so massive? I don't get it. If I go down there and make my way across, maybe there's something there? Oh, I might have done this area already, or I might have tried this bit already. Yeah, this may be a little bit too far for her, but let's give it a go. No, maybe not. All right, we're fine. Still nothing up here, though. What is... Oh, wait. What am I seeing down there? Or is that just the way in? Let's find out. Okay, that's just where we came in. Uh, there's got to be something down here, surely then. In this watery area? Let's have a hunt around. A switch or something, perhaps. Fuck off, rats. Alright, anything here? All right. 
try over here. Now. Anything here. Okay, no. Alright, up. Again. Kind of done this area too. It's funny because I feel like if this was a modern game, there would be arrows pointing me where I need to go, or the game would start to feel sorry for me, and it'd be like, you know, I've heard that if I tried this, it might get me to the next area. There was one thing that I meant to look at actually while I was here. Is it this? Little section here. Is that it? Nope, nothing there. And nothing really there, so what am I missing? Nope, nothing there. Anything? No. Okay. People are saying that there's apparently a key up where I was. I mean, if it is there, I do not know where, because I could not see anything there. I'll try it. Just to make you guys happy, I'll give it a go. See if I can find it. Maybe I did miss it. Okay. Let's try this. Okay, so we've unflooded the main level. See if there's anything that's changed. Will this section have filled up with water, perhaps? Yeah, people keep saying that the new textures make it really difficult to find whatever keys here, so. Alright, I'll have a look around with this.
Oh god, the frame rate. Oh my god. Look at that! Look at that! No wonder I couldn't fucking see it! Fuck you, game! I mean, thank you everyone for helping me with that one, because I honestly think I would have been like fucking 70 years old and still wandering around this level. Never would have seen that. That is absurd. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I get that you could kind of see it if you're right next to the good lord. That is abusive. Jesus. I probably need to flood the level again, actually, otherwise I can't get anywhere. Yeah, okay, fine. So... Yeah, I have to flood it again, because that was... I can't get around the main room if it's empty. Oh no, and I can't do that here. Fuck. Because I can't swim out. Okay, fine, let's go this way. Man, that is probably the longest I've been stuck on this game since I've replayed it. You know, there's been a few points up until now where I've been like a bit unsure about what to do next, but generally just a bit of looking around gets you where you need to be. That is crazy shit, man. I don't want to fall down too far because otherwise I'll cause more damage. Right. Gotta be a little bit more careful here because I could fall and injure myself. Let's see if we can figure out where we need to be now. Will this open any of the doors I need? Nope. Not if I do that. Can she make that jump? Yes. No. No indeed, huh? All right, fine. We'll play it your way, Lara, for now. Now I feel like I never trust this game with these crazy graphics. So, all right. And that's going to be a, a, a tricky one to do. Want to get over there and try those doors, I suppose. But it's going to be a tricky one with the water gone. Let's see if she can make this jump. Okay, this could be a bit of grappling involved in this, but off we go. It's this kind of fascinating, high-impact gameplay that you came here for, isn't it?
Come on, come on. save it because it's been a while. Oh, interesting. That one's further away. And I don't think she can make that. So I have to go to the other one. Please tell me this is the one I need. Yeah, okay. Super. We're progressing slowly. God, I can't wait to get past the cistern. That looks like spikes to me. Ah, yes, that is spikes. So I need to refill the room. Yeah. Otherwise, I'll just fall onto them and fucking die. Okay, fine. Let's go refill the cistern. Those grunts. <laughs> Siphon says Lara Croft was actually the first woman. Well, that's ludicrous. We all know that Jennifer Lawrence was the first woman. Come on now. <laughs> right. It's full up again. Lovely jubbly. Let's go. Definitely going to save here. <laughs> Everyone's like, save, drinker, save. Are you saying you don't have any faith in me? Is that it? Ooh, tight. Anything else in here? No. Key, you're yeah. and a med pack, please. And a random crocodile. Cause why not? Why not? I feel like it's probably gonna be this door next. I mean process of elimination and all that. Let me read a couple of super chats while I'm doing this. There you go, you can have a nice look at Lara. Sorry, I was so focused on the game, I couldn't see the chats. Uh, DB says, have you tried the All Saints code on Tomb Raider 2 yet? Uh, no, only back in the day. I haven't tried it on the new one. Um, uh, what's that? Johnny Bravo says, her vertical is nutty. Yeah, she can jump pretty damn high. Uh, the Nightmare says... 
why your Dune 2 review was age-restricted. Uh, your guess is as good as mine, mate. <laughs> I have no fucking idea. It was totally fine. And then like a day later, it came up as age-restricted and I couldn't advertise on it. As far as I know, there's nothing like that violates the YouTube terms of service or anything like that. So I don't know what their problem was. Uh, but I appealed it and they said no. So fuck it. Well, that's the way it goes sometimes. It's great when you put in days and days of work to review and put it out there and it's fine and then suddenly you can't get, can't make anything off it. So, lovely. Shaws says, thank you for all that you do. Love your reviews. Thank you very much, mate. Uh, Scott Christie Jones says, Lord of the Rings is mid compared to Dune is the best troll. Yeah. <laughs> that is a troll and a half. Fucking hell. It's like the same people who say that Blade Runner 2049 is far superior to the original. It's like, no, it's not. Albert Nada Retro says, just tried listening to Liz Moss reading The Handmaid's Tale. The book is as boring as it is hateful. I'm embarrassed that a Canadian wrote it. Well, I'll never know because I ain't going to read the fucking thing. Uh, Dee Breezy says, Drake series question. Uh, did Freya know uh, they went all Jason Bourne on Drake? Audio EFAP uh, on something to die for. Well, she did by the end. Like, I'm pretty sure he explained that to her and everything that had happened because they have a very long catch-up at the beginning of that book that I kind of skip over because it would just be reiterating everything that had already happened, but I'm pretty sure he explains it to her then. And BO10 says, Drink Here plays GTA 5 or Red Dead Redemption 2? Do it! I'd like to play Red Dead 2, actually, again. I've completed it already, but... Um, man, it's a fun game. It's just an impressive game as well. That open world's amazing. No. What do you mean, no? Okay, there's only one other door in this place, I guess. Hi. Some amazing animation there. No. Hmm. You could be an awkward one, aren't you, Lara? All right, let's try down here then. Fine. Is an area here that I have to do? I don't think so. I've pulled that lever already. Where are you? Where do you go? Oh yeah, that just opens that door, so that's fine. So this is the cistern room that's kind of partially flooded. There's no doors in here that I think I can get to. Oh, there's a key there, so... Need to find a way to get that open. Is there something through here that I need? Let's see. What's that? Nothing. Just a weird texture. <laughs> and there's no lever here that I need to press. pull this lever just to see what happens, just in case there's some crazy possibility there that I'm missing. No, 
Oh, that does is close it. Unless... Does it open a different door? So if it closes one, does it open another? Uh, Benjamin Perez says, Drinker, who would you cast as Lara? Well, if it had been a few years ago, I would have probably cast Haley Atwell. Because I think she's got the physique for it, for sure. The only problem is she's a bit old now. She's like 42 or something, so a little bit older. Fuck. Um, but yeah, otherwise I would have said she would have been a good choice because she's posh as fuck. She's hot. Would have thought she would have been a good choice. I feel like uh, it's a shame with that actress, actually. They've never quite found the roles for her. You know, and she definitely deserved it, but by this point in her career, you know, that's that's when they start to wind down a little bit, sadly, as actresses. It shouldn't always be that way, but it kind of is. Hopefully she'll get something out of the Mission Impossible movies, you know. She's going to be in Dead Reckoning Part 2, so that's something good. Nope, nothing there. Okay, carry on then. Pull that again and then go back into the main area and then try unflooding the place. Right, up. Okay, so I've got a key and I don't know where to use it. logical thing to do is try unflooding it, because presumably there's a reason why you can flood and unflood the place. So I just kind of want to look over there as well, because I don't fully trust this game anymore. Nah, there ain't nothing there. <laughs> oh, Dixon Cider says Claudia Black from 20 years ago. Yeah, I could get behind that one, and I could get behind her. <laughs> no, she had the build. She had kind of the accent, like, oh, she's... I actually thought she was British back when she was in her Farscape days. She's Australian, obviously, but um, she masks the accent pretty good. I wonder if there's something up there. <coughs> Is this one of those hidden keys that's up here? Oh, you motherfucker. Someone definitely needs to have a word with these level designers. Okay. I have keys. Hopefully I can do things with them. figure out where we can unlock. Surely one of them is going to unlock that big door up there. Yeah, we're not going to make that.
that jump, I don't think. Have to go down. Gravity Boys is the key thing is the reason not to buy this game. It's not a game breaker, but yeah, it's clearly something you just need to be aware of if you're going to be playing this. And I think it's probably just this level. It's so like dark and dingy, like the keys just don't stand out enough. No. All right, use the other one then. No. Bitch. That pure pisses me off, like... Hmm... Don't tell me I got a shimmy. I don't want a shimmy. Don't make me shimmy. I don't actually need to. I can get up on the block that way. I do sort of have hazy memories of this level being a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Reposition. Get up there. Skeptical Bucketman says, don't worry, Drinker, even Melanie got stuck here for a while. Fucking, really? Melanie? She's like a fucking Tomb Raider veteran. I expected more. See, yeah, my excuse is that I'm just shite. Oh, no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <clears throat> Fight in 90 says, this is your favorite map. Is it though? Why? <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to save it in a sec. Because god damn. Yeah, I can't wait to get past this one, man. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, it's got to be that one, surely.
What a fascinating room this is. And there's a crocodile here, apparently. I've got to start over here, then. Hypnohype says, Hello, Drinker. Are you enjoying this game? Would you recommend it? I am, despite a few slight frustrations. And it's partly just... Yeah, partly just the new textures. They're Normally, they're fantastic, but when you're looking for things like keys, man, it makes your life a misery. I got this asshole as well. Where are you? Where's he shooting me from? There you are. It's over, Pierre. I have the high ground. Yeah. If you want to run away, like a pussy. Fair enough. Oh dear, this would be a terrible place for him to start shooting at me. Uh. Yeah, I know I missed the med pack, but I don't really care about that. Whoa, okay. This is a big room. Okay, switch over there. Super duper. I can't get over there yet. Yeah, it's going to have to be from that side and up. Yeah, I have to go down to the bottom of the room then. Okay, fine. Crocodile dead. Other crocodile. Right, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, fuck's sake. Are these like endlessly respawning or something? Are you done? Any more? Wait, no, that's not what I want. That's what I want. I'm going to put these shitty old textures on. So I don't miss things like that. Or keys, for example. Okay, nothing too special there. That's fine. Let's carry on then. So we need to get up to the switch, flick it, and away we go. Hey, you should have been able to make that. Normally you can just leap up and glitch onto it. Uh, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Huge Hawk says the next level is the Colosseum. Now I've done this Colosseum already. Okay.
Yeah, the chosen one. The crunch sound when she falls and dies. The best thing ever. It really is a brutal one. Okay, switch, go. Alright, don't really want to fall down there, do we? The question is, what's in here that's important? There must be something that I have to pick up here. Yeah, I can't believe I came all this way just to open a door. And it's a door back to an area that I've already been to. Is that literally all it is, just to open the door? Why? Try and get around these things. Uh, yeah, I'll save that before I try it. So, I haven't been in this room when it's... Fine, I'm going to put the... Yeah, I'm going to put the old textures on so I can see things a little better. I wonder if there's a way to fuck around with the brightness a little bit. Change it up. So, there's a door there, but... Can't get to it. So, there has to be a way to open it up. Oh, maybe it's just... Oh, yeah, it's the fact that I couldn't jump this before. Right, that makes sense. Okay. Some of the logic's starting to fall into place slowly, because I'm stupid. So I gotta go that way. Key. I could be wrong, but I sense I'm getting close to vacating this place. <laughs> yep. And did myself some damage at the same time. Well done, drinker. Please tell me I'm almost done with the cistern. I hate this place. Uh, 
No, I don't need to swim that way, actually. Let's just go here. Way to go up to there. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> dummy. Every time I got that right, apart from then, I don't know why I took a run and jump at it. Fucking idiot. Alex's channel says, only a true messiah denies his divinity. Yeah, it's funny how they just kept making up rules to justify it. It was like a Monty Python sketch. Okay. Please, please tell me this is the key I need. Yes! <laughs> Uh, right, I'm fuck it. I'm saving it here. Like, I sense a fight with Pierre coming on. What's in here? Ah, literally nothing, eh? Smart, unexpected, I would say. Got to do more climbing, have we? Well, that door is not going to open itself, so I guess so. <laughs> I like how that monkey's just just chilling, just hanging out. It's almost like he's waiting to activate. <laughs> Damn, son. You took some killing. <sighs> Alright, please tell me I've got this key that I need. Alright. It's always nice when you get those little zoom out shots and you can see yourself. Right. Let's get something a bit more enjoyable. Interesting. No, I want to pull that lever. with this massive room. I don't get it. Seems a bit unnecessary. Oh well. Who am I to argue? I think they definitely spawned in more enemies than they used to have. Climb up there. I wonder if I need to push a block in here or something. Go 
Gonna need something to help me climb up there. There it is. There's the magical block that I need. I can't believe you're actually gonna make me pull this all the way into that room. You scumbags. I feel like I could do all the super chats while she's pulling it. If only I could automate it. Anything I'll have to be thinking about over here? Probably not. Ugh. All right, come on then, pull it, Lara. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I am going to do super chats while this is going on. Uh, Noose says, Hey, drinker, just watched Kelly's Heroes with my dad and had a blast. Any movie recommendations on the same vein as that movie? Much love. Um, probably um, Where Eagles Dare. That's an absolute classic war movie. And it's, yeah, not as, it's not funny like Kelly's Heroes, but it's the same idea. Um, good fun. And... Oh, what's the next one? Dixon Cider says, here's a fiver for reading stuff even from people who don't pay. Of course! Like, God. I'm just here to have fun, man. But thank you, I appreciate it. Uh, oh, is it coming? Is it going to move? Yeah, there we go. Uh, Adez says, thank you for these morning game streams. They've been great entertainment. Appreciate that, man. Just, just trying to have a bit of fun with it. Uh, B10 says, what's your OnlyFans called, Drinker? <laughs> Give it a few time. Give it a, a little bit of time for me to get in shape and I'll do it. Uh, Andrew McCarty says, can you explain the end of the Donner Cut? Basically, Superman blows up the fortress, then turns the world back to the start of the film and makes everything irrelevant and Zod is back in the Phantom Zone. It's a bit of a weird one. I'm not sure I entirely can explain it, if I'm honest with you. Yeah, it's... Um, they had an interest in history at those Superman movies. Oh, I need to pull this for some reason. I don't know why I have to pull it, but I assume it opens one door by closing another. So let's see if we can get up here. All right, so we're upstairs. Possibly a bit of overkill, but I don't care. Magazine, sure, but uh, there's got to be something else up here. Nothing there. Mm, I find it hard to believe that the game puts you to all that work just to do that and nothing else. Something around here, perhaps. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> uh, well, let's go back downstairs and see what's there, I guess. If I pulled that out... Oh, wait. Ah, okay. Let's just save it before we go down there. <laughs> Good lord. That was an hour and a half it took to do that. Okay, never want to do that again.
We need you. Come on, go forward. Flick the switch, Lara. You're making me look like an asshole here. Okay, can't do it. Fine. Why can you not pull that switch? Am I actually gonna run out of oxygen here? It's literally not working. I'm trying to pull it. Okay, I need to go down and refill my oxygen. Oh no, I'm not gonna make it. Blah. <laughs> Look at that. Look how close. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Restart level. Okay, so that switch. I can't actually flick that because we can't do it with water in here. So, okay. How do I get out? Is there anything else along this area that I need to find? No. I can't go that way because it's blocked. Oh, here we go. Whoops. My bad. There we go, yeah. Before we die, you just put that extra bit of level geometry there to mess things up for me. Damn. That's rather annoying. <laughs> Let us get past this room as quick as we can, shall we? Damn water levels, I tell ya. Makes me sick! What's over here? Nothing.
That was some high speed water boating right there. Now what? Do I need those? Not really. Hello, random guy. Is he going to run away now? <sighs> oh, whoops. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh, I remember these. We get Simon, right? Where'd he go? I'll oh, have you. So, there's a door there, I need to get it open. And that means I need to do some investigating. Secret. <laughs> All that for some shotgun shells. <laughs> okay. Sure. Oh no, there's I tell why. There's also a med pack there, so it's better than nothing. Who am I to complain, really? Okay, so there's nothing else down there that I need, so back to the main chamber, I guess? Oh, them again. Oh, there's a scythe there. Right, I think I understand what they want me to do here. Kind of don't want to go all the way down again, though. Might have to. Is there a way to get over to this 
Yes, there is. Yeah, I'm not going to make that jump. No way. It has to be from over here. I don't know if it was always like that, where you could actually see the scythe just waiting for you there. There it goes. So I'm going to have to get right up to the edge. Try and time this right. Wish me luck, boys. Yeah, Sarah's like, how long has that pendulum been swinging? And I, did they really have motion-activated technology back, like, 2,000 years ago when they built this place? Guess so. Yeah, Dixon Cider, these ancient civilizations and their perpetual motion machines. Oh, we filled this place up again. Now what am I to do? Oh, okay, so maybe I fall down there and climb up there? It's possible. Save that. Yeah, I really want to get away from these like slimy water logged levels. I mean, this is the tomb of Tehokan, so I know this is like the last stage of this area. It takes us on to somewhere else. Ooh. I think we then go to Natla's Mines, probably. Interesting. I don't think I've got any keys left. Nope. much of a shot at these guys. And there's spikes below me, so what can go wrong? As the dude says, hello, drinker and everyone. Hello to you, as the dude. Yeah, all right, keys. <laughs> no. 
We'll check. Was that guerrilla warfare? I see what you did there. Oh, crap. Uh, right, how do we get past this one? Because there's spikes there. That's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. How was that? Okay. It's another little puzzle. I'm assuming these things sink or something. Won't just be as simple as running over them. It really is as simple as just running over them. That's weird. Alright, there's a lot of doors in here. Well... Yeah. Are these pressure plates? I guess they must be. I see stuff in there. Okay. Guess let's push this out of the way. <laughs> Is there an area up above that I need to try and access? <laughs> All right, let's yeah, let's try and put it on one of these bits with text and see if it does anything. I guess that's what you're meant to do. One open. And I sense there's gorillas in here. It's cool that these ancient Mayans and stuff, they, they left shotgun shells and magnum rounds lying around for me. It's just tremendously thoughtful, I would say. Right, next plate. <laughs> next one. Okay, it's over here. Oh no. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Alex's channel says, I find it amazing that people are casually raiding people's grave in so many of these shows. I mean, yeah, but it's fun, you know? They should have looked after their stuff better. I don't 
think there's anything particularly... Oh, I suppose I should get it. Just in case I need it. Take the shotgun shells as well, because they're always handy. As Kratos said, they no longer need them. Quite right, Big Doe. in here. Alright. That's weird, but fine. Which way do I want to go now? Alright, key, yeah. Uh... So they try and bait you in with that med pack there, and you think, ah, how nice, a lovely med pack. I'll have that, and then splat, you're dead. True story. Uh, ah, do we need two? Makes sense, I guess. Right, let's push this over here. <laughs> Jesus! Now, I'm not much good at counting, but I would have said there was at least 10 million of them there. Another room that I totally don't trust. Just a med pack. Okay, so... That leaves one more, and I'm assuming that it leads me to the door up above, which will be a puzzle room. And then get the second key, and then that takes us into Tihokin's tomb. It's always something. surely. Oh, there it is. Another invisible key, A. Where you're going, buddy boy.
Holy shit, we just got spat out of mouth. <laughs> Someone's asking me, Drinker, can you remove the age restriction on your last review? <laughs> I'd love to, man. It's not me that put it on. It's YouTube. The wonderful folks there. It's this place. Yeah, I had nothing to do with that one. Unfortunately. Oh, come on, Lara. Jesus, you're better than that. This is a weird looking place. The sand textures and stuff are all wrong. Okay, yeah, underwater tunnel. Here we go. Do we want to go that way? Is that the way we want to do this? Do we feel confident about this? Nope. Oh yeah, it might be that we can't actually get back up. Oh no, we can. just left. Is it? Do we have something here that's interesting? Not really. <clears throat> Alright, what I'm gonna do, I think... Let me get up here. looks ominous. Alright, give me a second. Uh, new, I'm going to do these super chats here. Noose, so you probably already asked this, but what are your thoughts on the Crow movie coming up? I'm getting Jared Leto Joker flashbacks. Yeah, me too. I don't think you're going to improve upon the original, man. It was pretty awesome. Lines on paper says, Drinker, have you ever seen the film Oh Brother uh, Asher Art, though? <laughs> it's one of my favourites, and I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Do you mean like Oh Brother, Where Art Thou? Otherwise, yeah, I don't know what this one is. Um, Glenwood Reed says, Honourable Mention, Black, PlayStation 2, and Night Stalker. Yes. Jay Smart says, We wanted her to be shapely, and then, while a brick is technically a shape, that's not what we meant. <laughs> yeah, very true. Um, Shara says, Shout out to my YouTube show, Traders of the Lost Charts, on the Rocky Outcrop YouTube channel. We talk charts with friends. Don't drown, drinker. I'll try. Finbar White says, Drinker, what's been your favourite trip abroad? Cheers. Um, whoa, good question. Probably when I went to uh, Abu Dhabi. That was pretty awesome. Um, and Magnum Norse says, Jiggle them cakes, drinker. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> um, anyway, I'm going to stop there for now because we've been going for quite a while. Um, but follow me next time for the next little adventure in Tomb Raider land. But anyway, go away now.